continuing education in the kitchen. Once again, back with us to try to teach me to cook is Mr. Charles Knight, the creator of Health hey. Cookware. <laughs> What's cooking? Oh, you tell me. This is uh, turkey piccata. Yes. That, haven't I heard of something like uh, veal piccata? Veal piccata, yes. Yeah, and this is turkey piccata right. made we, the same we way. Couldn't, we couldn't cook peel. Uh, <laughs> you couldn't cook my, veal. I couldn't cook that either. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Got my nose fixed. My mouth doesn't work anymore. <laughs> so we don't cook veal anymore because Karen gets upset. Oh, you know, that's, that's true. Great. So yeah, we I have to cook turkey. That's good. It really is veal, but we're not going to call it. <laughs> well, yeah. anyway, no, it is. It's really turkey. What does piccata mean? I have no idea. <laughs> you know, when you, I, I was thinking that was I'm something in a musical instructions. You know, when you saw piccata, you started singing fast. Okay. <laughs> but it, apparently that's not it. Or it was an old West Virginia dance. The way I'm no. going, yeah, West Virginia dance. <laughs> Turkey piccata. Would you like to get right. on the floor and piccata with me? <laughs> Sounds like very good. Anyway, you ready to get going? Yes, I am. This is one of those deals where I'm going to teach you to do two things at one time again. You mean at the same time? At the same time. All right. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. First thing we're going to do is we're going to get the turkey ready. All right? That doesn't even now, look like turkey. Well, that's turkey. That's a turkey breast. All right? Well, I'll be darned. Now, what, I'm going to get a little bit thinner one here. Let's get this one right here. I'll make it easy okay, for you. Okay, those. What I want you up. to do is I want you to whack that. A flat with, turkey. I want you to whack it with the pan. These are our new gourmet pans, by the way. So. Oh, look at that. That's look what they're the good for. Is that nice? Gold. Yeah, it's gold handles. Gold 24 handles karat on it? gold. There you Just go. whack it like whack that it with hard. a pan? Whack it. You mean you spend all that money for this? Whack it. And you use it like this? <laughs> well, it's better than a hammer. <laughs> not, that's not too bad. Look, you're doing very well. Very well. Whoa. There you go. Is it dead yet? You're almost. Let's flip it over on the other side. Very good. How about giving Jack oh. a big hand? He knows how to mess with <laughs> your pan. He did a good job. Okay. Now, a right. little bit of olive oil in the pan. Olive oil. Is that I'll, this one or this one here? Uh, that's that one. This one. Very good. Oh, it says olive oil. There you go. I'm going to trim okay. this a little. Now, you tell me how much. Uh, about two ounces should do, or, or less. <laughs> a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Very good, very good. Now is move enough? around, move is around, it's hot. Is that enough? Yes, that's plenty. Okay, All right. that was two now, ounces. Now what we're going to do is, you got to remember when you're doing this. Remember we talked about wet hand, dry hand? Wet hand, dry hand. Wet hand, dry hand. Okay. Oh, this thing. This thing, okay. Which I've hand, forgotten which how Which hand goes. is your wet hand? Uh, this, this will one. be my wet okay. hand. Okay, and that hand will be your dry hand. Okay. Yeah. So which one do you flip it over with? I would imagine with my dry hand. No, your wet hand. My wet hand, okay. <laughs> Just turn it over yes. like this? Yes. Okay, okay, and that's it. That's it. Now, <laughs> let, well. me, let me turn this down a little bit. Okay. We're ready to cook. Just throw it in the pan. Throw this in the yeah. pan. With your dry hand. With a dry <laughs> hand? Why is that's that? That's what your dry hand's for. Why is that? Because that's so you don't get, make uh. a mess. Okay, there you go. Now so I have two wet hands. Anyway. <laughs> okay. So we got the veal. We got the veal. Excuse me, Gary. We have the turkey piccata cooking. Now, what this we're really gonna... is veal, isn't yes. it? Yes. No, it isn't. It's turkey. It's really turkey? It's really turkey. Okay. All right. It's really turkey. Okay. Now we're going to cook some vegetables. So, what I need you to do is fill that pan up with a little bit of broccoli, cauliflower, and some, a little bit faster. <laughs> this segment will be over. I miss my okay. commercial. There you go. You could pick up the whole bowl like this, you know. Oh, okay. Like, kind of how it works. Okay. There you go. All right. Now, these are yes. tomatoes. No, they are red peppers. Red peppers. Right. Okay, a little bit of, little garlic. Bit of garlic. garlic. Not all of it. Oh. oh. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, oh. we're cooking this without water. I'm going to put a little bit of chicken stock for flavoring. Chicken right. stock. Chicken stock for flavoring. Don't gonna tell put... Karen, but that's really veal stock. Veal stock. Okay. By the way, you know, I've been traveling all over the country. I met somebody in Colorado that knew you. Oh, really? Yeah, from junior high school. You're kidding. Said she had a crush on She sent me this gift. She told me to oh, give you these. Oh, here we go. I don't even want to see, see it. <laughs> she said, <laughs> she, <laughs> I remember. She, she said she'd re, you remember her. Yeah, Tina. <laughs> Tina, yes. <laughs> Look like two okay. people. <laughs> anyway, okay. Now, this is doing very well. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to flip this. All right. Okay, let me with put what? A little, bit, little bit more. With, with your, a wet hand or the dry hand? It uh, doesn't make any difference. With either hand. What, you're right-handed, correct? Oh, you mean flip it flipping, with a pan? Flipping, yes. Ready? Okay, do it. Now, this, like, do it. No, no, no. <laughs> Up. All right. <laughs> oh, I hate to do that. Look, look at this over here. That's all right. I, Don't try this at home, folks. Boy, you're getting good. That's a, that's the first oh, time you made it over. I know. It's a good thing we didn't have an egg involved in this recipe. Yeah, last okay. time it was on its side. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull this out of here. It's not cooked, but you get the basic idea. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to make the piccata sauce. Yes. Okay. Very important. So we'll put pull that out. Put that on the side. A little bit of uh, oops, sorry. A little bit of this. 
Chicken that's stock. chicken stock. What that's going to do is deglaze the pan. That's all right. That's what it's supposed to do. Is that it? Is yes. that enough? No, a little bit more. What you're doing is you're deglazing the pan. That's what they call deglazing. Uh -huh. Okay, to that, a little bit of parquet margarine. Okay. You can use a towel. It's okay. Or you uh, can use these if you want. How much? Right? <laughs> <laughs> you, you wipe everything on your... A little bit. About, two, about yeah, just a little, a little bit more. A little bit more. So I okay. Piccata sauce is, that is doing good? well. That's good. That's good. Okay. I'll turn this off. Okay, now here's how easy this piccata sauce is to make. Once you've got this going, all right, mm -hmm. you just add a little bit of that. That is, is parsley, parsley and lemon pepper, uh, lemon basil. Not all of it. Oh. Oh. Okay, well, that's all right. That's all right. <laughs> Can't get much no of that problem. out of there, I'll tell you that. Right. Now you want to mix that around. Okay. Right? You yeah. get me a plate. See how nice and thick it's becoming? A plate. A plate in the, cu in the cupboard. Right up there, over there. Where, over here? Yes, over there. I knew there was one somewhere. A plate. A plate. Any plate. That one's too small, I guess. Huh? No, that's fine. We use that. Okay. Because it'll take you all day to find anything bigger, right? All anyway, right. What you would do is you put this on a plate, and then the piccata sauce goes around the turkey, so like you see So all that is here. is butter and yeah. stock. And Very simple. Parsley. It's real simple. That's how simple. That's a lemon. That's a lemon basil. That's how simple and easy to make. Was there any lemon in turkey. there? Yes. Oh. <laughs> Uh, no. <laughs> but they're supposed to be. <laughs> After, all <laughs> After all we these years. After all these years. We forgot the lemon. But you get the idea. Yeah. Anyway, this is what it looks like when it's all done. See, isn't that pretty? Got leaves okay. on it. Got some leaves on it. They are. Oh, LJ. And there's your vegetables. Have you picked a great day to be and here. A big old plate of vegetables. Let me. Uh, and you're all set. Get my, how do you feel about vegetables, by the way? Leaves? Huh? Can I see the leaves? <laughs> oh, I wouldn't. <laughs> Heaven knows where those came from. I'd eat around the leaves. You can just eat one of the ends. Do you like vegetables? A little bit of them. Oh, I, I'm the same way as you are. Maybe once a month or something like that. Well, try a little of that veal piccata. Let, I mean, well, I'm me, sorry, me, the uh, turkey me, piccata. Let me cut it for me. Okay, you're going to cut some no, here? Let me cut a little piece for you right here. Okay. Right. This is not going to burn them or anything, is it? No, no, no. It's cold. Okay. <laughs> and does this have lemon in it? <laughs> yes, that has lemon in it. Okay. Now, let's get a good, tight shot of his face here as we try this out. You're not Spilled supposed a little to wear food there. You're yeah. supposed to eat it there. <laughs> Slopped a little on you, LJ, but... You, you like, like that? Oh, Is right. it really terrific? What's... <laughs> I gotta find out. What, what's your favorite food? If you could have any food at all and you'd have to eat it for two weeks, what would it be? Pizza. Huh? Pizza? pizza? That's your favorite food? Okay, well, this tastes a little like pizza. This is like pizza piccata. Have you ever tried that? <laughs> it's really great. Hey, if you'd like to get a copy of the recipe, it's Karen's Piccata. <laughs> Karen's Piccata, Box 888-TAMPA-33601. And please send a stamp self-addressed envelope, and we'll get a copy of that to you. And meanwhile, our thanks to Charles right. Knight, creator of Healthcraft Cookware, and LJ, our eater. And we'll be back in a moment to find out what it's like to be a Virgo. <laughs>